Alrighty guys, so in today's video we're going to be covering quite a few different tokens because I can see one particular gem that's going to do absolutely parabolic whereas the rest of the cards will do quite well in the space of memes and we're going to kick off the show with with Chloe and it looks like Chloe is doing pretty well so far guys because if you've been following my channel I've also said to you that I can see Chloe do more than 100x well I'll say 100x minimum but clearly there was still a hype within Chloe and I can see Chloe doing exceptionally well now so far for today we are currently up by 54% and there are certain levels that we need to break in order for us to see a much higher price coming in for Chloe but before we do anything else guys why don't we just do a wide screen so we can see exactly where Chloe is at at the minute Right, so we had this massive run of course, then we gone sideways for a little bit and then we saw some life where we saw a huge, well a pretty decent spike from this ground level up here. Then we retraced before we continued up, we didn't continue much higher or much further higher up from here. Instead we capitulated back down, down, to, down to these levels over here for another retest but as you can clearly notice guys, from these lows over here to these lows here that the chart is looking like it's pointing uh, to go to the upside. Reason why? Because this area here is like the lowest of low, then these areas here is actually higher than these lows. So it gives me great confidence that we should be seeing much higher prices coming in for Chloe. And as soon as we break this green line, call that a resistance, our next leg up should be way up here. And that will put the price of Chloe at 0.0003. So yes guys, so that would be a nice move to the upside, even if you're looking for a short term trade from here to there, you should be expecting another 139% move to the upside, oh actually that's not as accurate, let's call it there around about, that's 144% move to the upside from the current price, however, however guys, I won't be looking for any, well, yeah maybe I am. I've already got a couple of trades going on and I've also got a holding position for Chloe. So yes, this could be another potential short, but I'm already heavily invested in terms of uh, the holding strategy for Chloe and I've actually got three positions on the short term. So I guess I could add one more, which wouldn't be too bad. All in all, it would give me a huge, 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 huge um, profit by looking at from the short term but i might just add a bit more to my long haul uh watch this end my holding strategy and get even more in the near future of course nothing is guaranteed guys this is not financial advice just informing you exactly what i'm doing but anyway chloe is looking rather healthy so far once we do break above here guys i'll be super bullish that once we do break here this should be the next level and after here guys within off the races and get much higher highs the question is how high can we go guys this is pretty decent meme project it's actually quite funny i've always thought you know could chloe ever become a meme coin that eventually it does a um, couple of things that i would do in order for me to have like a stronger guesstimate in terms of the prices for chloe in the near future first of all i will always tend to go for the Fibonacci retracement tool because it gives me an idea by using some mathematical equations. So let's say for example we, we will go right from the top and we'll measure it all the way down to the bottom to the lowest low which would be down here of course and then once we do scroll up we can see where the Fibonacci retracement tool will end and it will end roughly around about up here but usually we take notes that it should be around about the purple level down here but let's say if we do that anyway right down here so that'll put the price at 0 0.006 otherwise right from top here that'll put the price at 0 0.007 now let's say just for entertainment purposes that we do measure from the top of the Fibonacci retracement tool from the current price oh, actually why don't we just get a bit more why don't we be a bit more accurate actually just to give you a idea what sort of price range should we um, you know be maybe considering 
but I believe that we should go much higher than the Fibonacci retracement tool is stating only because I do believe there's a lot more hype and marketing team will probably come in and do something amazing to help support uh, this project to go much higher. So even at the top of the Fibonacci retracement tool from the current price is at 6,444, so 43%. Move to the upside. So that's easily, easy look at that guys. It's like 60 times to know your initial trade. But if you've been, but if you've been adding more to the bags as we're going sideways for the longest, that would be like a huge, huge gains for the near future. However, I still reckon we get 100% out of it, so 100x out of this regardless. So that's, so that is my uh, take on Chloe, and I'm, I still am super bullish and I always will be bullish on Chloe. Now, why don't we head to the next project, which would be Cheers Token. Cheers Token for today, they are 20% down, However, I'm also super bullish for this one. And as we can see from the chart for Cheers Token, guys, check this out. We finally see some life. Um, I've been accumulating a lot more down here. I was so late for the party. <laughs> and I was just accumulating and adding more bags right over here. Made a little profit there, but I've held on because I wanted to see how much high can we go and whether we could break this level up here. That didn't quite happen. Then we pulled back. As we were pulling back, I was adding a lot more to my bags. Then it went sideways for, for quite a long while. And now we start to finally see some life coming into Cheers Token. Cheese tokens perhaps you know, one of my biggest holds of, of, of all the meme coins and I do believe we're going to see some huge gains coming in also for cheese token. I would be surprised if this is also 100x um, or more. You know what? Even if it gets up to 1000x from here, I wouldn't be all too surprised. Either way guys, I'm positioning myself well and I'm adding a lot more to my bags. But it's a shame that I didn't catch this on you know, in time before it ripped the market from here all the way to up to there. I would have taken some profit and reinvested back in. That would be that. Would, that is a generally generally that's my uh, strategy. But either way, guys, I digress. But it looks it looks like now that we are on the verge of at least completing this move. And once we do a break up from this level up here, oh, actually, hang on a second, guys, you can barely see it. <laughs> so once we do, in fact break up from this level up here then we should be off to the races because if I was to just zoom out from the charts so you can see quite clearly that once we do break up from this level we should be on the upper end of the charts and then once we do continue to make our way up then we should in no time hit our high highs and hopefully get into this discovery phase within the next couple of months this is certainly one of the projects which I do believe we can easily see a 100x. So I've already given you two projects that will give you a 100x return and maybe even more. I do believe Cheers Token has got the staying power and in fact as long as the project is coming out with you know new information and, it's, and the market team is working well and there are some rumors of course that there will be some sort of like a you know, gaming, like a you know, play to earn more Cheers Token. So guys, there could be a lot more developments coming out from Cheers Token. Right, so let's check out the other cryptocurrencies. So the next one will be the one that I've actually spotted a few days ago actually. And it only until yesterday when I've actually entered in Nintendo. Guys, Nintendo is still a very fresh market. Look at this guys. It's extremely new and worth getting into. This could be my alternative to the Cheers token because I missed that during the inception and we're virtually brand new. Look at this guys. As we opened up the market, we actually did pull back a little, then we went straight up to the top, then we held up above this level here. Guys, this is a golden opportunity, I believe that we can quite easily see maybe even 100x in a shorter time scale than your cheese token and your uh, Chloe. This game, this is a quite a risky play. Uh, it's a Nintendo CTO. <laughs> I never thought the day that I'll see a cryptocurrency, well, a meme token that's called Nintendo. Guys, this could be an extremely, extremely lucrative 
uh, coin to get into, well, at least during the early stages, because I could see uh, Nintendo doing something like as Cheese Token first came out. As you can see here, guys, we went side to a little bit before we absolutely ripped the market. Now, this move here could exactly happen to Nintendo because, guys, I'm sure you all remember Nintendo. I used to have one back in the day, and uh, guys, this could be a really popular uh, next gem. Currently, the market cap is only 588, and the total um, total supply is just under one billion and they're all in circulation yes so i can see this one doing exceptionally well or at least for the next coming few weeks so it might be worth investing a small part you know of your uh, trading portfolio in this one nothing's financial advice it could be extremely risky either way guys i've already placed quite a bit in this one because i'm i can afford to lose uh, whatever amount that i put in and guys i'm already up on more than 200 percent and it's currently 169 percent moved to the upside so let's keep an eye on this one guys and see what goes on with this one right guys now this next one is called fluff a fluffy on soul and guys i just saw the shape of the chart and i thought to myself you know what this could be a risky play but but ultimately you could also give um, me some nice juicy rewards usually with high risk uh, tokens the riskier it is the the most uh, rewarding it can be so that's why you know, i'm keeping my eyes on what goes on here i'm just waiting for certain levels um in fact once we do come back up into this level up here and we break above i could be looking to get into a trade for this one because i can actually see that massive potential coming in for the fluffy so once we do enter from here i'll be expecting the first tech profit around about there at 369 percent move to the upside and with some of these meme guys i'll be only looking for like a day trade i'm not looking to hold for the long haul in fact even if i did my profit target will be at least back up to this high high and i probably would just come out and take off my profit you know once if we do reach back up to this level which i'm sure that we would do but it wouldn't be a long play for myself i've already got quite i've already stacked myself quite a few uh coins as part of my portfolio hodling uh for the long haul these memes here is primarily for my day trade and guys you can still make you know, an insane game without having to use any uh, leverage trading but you have to also remember guys that it is a lot more riskier you can actually lose all your money and potentially if it's a scam coin or no claiming back of your funds but for these ones guys you know it's been verified and checked it looks like it's not a scam coin at all but it's still going to be highly volatile and still a risk of play so only prepare to trade with the money that you can afford to lose and guys this could be a exceptionally decent possible trade so that's why I marked up the levels where I'll be looking to buy. Once we come down up in this areas over here, I'll be loading up at least for a short term trade and with a target of this level up here. Now that will give me easily over 300%. Uh, I think I did say 369% from here to up there. Well, actually, that's 341% move to the upside. That's an easy 3x, which then I can use the gains from this trade and I can funnel it or feed it to other cryptocurrencies from my list over here. Now, these are just my meme playlist, or should I say my meme list. So that wraps up on Fluffy. Let's go check out what's happening with Black Hawk Indy. Okay guys, so for Blackhawk Inu, it's still looking like we are ranging within the side over here. We're just waiting for this move until it breaks above this box level over here. Now Blackhawk Inu is also one of the coins that I was completely late. I was so late for Blackhawk Inu. And yeah, I've actually got in right about here originally. It went up, then it came back down, then it continued to staircase its way back down, all the way down to the ground floor over here. For me, I'm still super bullish on Blackhawk Inu and I've been accumulating a lot more like a boss around this level over here. Guys, this is still going to give us an easy, easy 100x, maybe even 1000x on this coin. So as you can imagine, as the thumbnail has stated, that all of these are an easy 100x tokens. We just got to be patient to wait to see those crazy 
gains. So once the bull season start popping off, you will see all the meme coins, including all the major coins that's in your top 50, just blasting off. And these meme coins, it will certainly be blasting off. That is for sure. With Black Kokini, how much percentage or well, how much excess can we see coming in for them? Guys, who knows? But I'm speculating that it can easily go up to 100x, maybe even a lot more. But for the meantime, I'll be looking for you know more positions, you know, within my uh, Black Kokini holding because even though I've got too much bags already, but whilst we're still stuck in range, it's always worth adding more because once we do blow up from this area then guys we should be then heading away off to the races and make our way back up to the top of the black hawk in your prices and from there guys we could only just see what happens from there but i'm super duper ultra bullish on black cock in you and guys if you got any comments leave that in the comment section of course let me know which one that you're super bullish on and let's see what happens within this space for the final coin that we'll be talking about today it's going to be success kid and guess what guys success kid is still ranging sideways here for a little while and we can still see an easy 100x from here if you look at the chart in general we've just been going sideways here for the longest guys this is still a very good sign because the longer we go sideways then the more likely that we're going to see a huge move coming up for success kid and you will notice in the economy it did actually went up to around about 55 cents i i believe this coin can easily go over yeah well over uh five six dollars if you look at the charts yeah it's not painting a decent picture right now but it is going sideways that is for, for a fact we haven't had a huge correction or dump from these levels over here which is great in fact if you look at the chart generally speaking it does look like as if we are slowly creeping our way up a little bit but only from this level here which has gone literally flat line and gone straight this will be a perfect accumulation phase before we ultimately retest and go back to this high up here now if we bring out the measuring tool measure from the current price to run right about the top of the last high highs we can be expecting quite easy 383 percent move to the upside however like i said guys i can still see this one to be a nice easy play for 100x it may even go a thousand x the community is still, still strong of course and people are still raving about success kid to be one of their best meme plays for the coming bull season but anyway guys i hope you did find this useful and informative and if you haven't done so already do me a favor give me a like subscribe hit the bell notification so you'll be updated for all my latest content videos and if you haven't subscribed to me yet you may subscribe over here if you'd like to check out my last two videos check them out here and there and i'll see you all in the next one